Alrighty, so recap, recap, um, yesterday we entered Cosmo Canyon, that is actually where Red's our team is from, and we found out a little bit more about his past. Um, they don't go into it too much in this game, but from what I remember of the, like, Japanese-only phone mobile game, um, Red 13 was taken from Cosmo Cannon, I think by the Turks, back to Shinra to be a test, ex like, test subject or experiment. Rebecca, enjoy your food! Um, so that was a thing. Um, we found out more about Red 13's, uh, parents. He thought that his father had abandoned him and his mother. It turns out his father was actually protecting the, um, their home, I guess, from invaders. Um, so that was really nice. It's a beautiful scene. Um, and I love the music there. Then we went onwards to the next town, which is Nibelheim. That is actually the town that Cloud and Tifa are from. And the weird thing going on there was that the town burned down five years ago. Cloud and Tifa both, they both know that. It burnt down. They hadn't been back since. You walk into this town and it is identical. And the people living there don't remember Cloud and Tifa. They say they've been there their whole lives. Um, there's these figures in capes who are going on about reunions, so that's kind of sus. Um, so what we did, we went down into the... Hi, Platista! We did not go down to Platista. <laughs> that was an awkward place to pause. How are you doing? Good morning. Um, we went down into the basement of the Nibelheim Mansion. We found our second to last party member. His name is Vincent. He is on my team. He is one of my favorites. Uh, he is formerly a Turk from Shinra, but it was many, many years ago. Uh, he's had a lot of ish happen, and he pretty much locked himself in a coffin and had a moment for years about it. And that's kind of Vincent. We love him. We love him. <laughs> uh, next, we went through the Nibelheim, uh, or Nib Mount Nibel, I guess. Uh, proceeded on to Rocket Town, which is where we got our final party member. His name is Sid. Uh, he is an ex-Shinra, like, astronaut that never actually got off the ground, so that's kind of his whole thing. Um, he swears a lot. I'm hoping a lot of his dialogue is reworked for the compilation going forward. Um, and then we went and did kind of like some optional content centered around Yuffie. Uh, we went to her home of Wutai, which is obviously the place that Shinra had been in war with for a while. You hear about that quite a bit. Uh, in this game, and especially in Crisis Core. Um, and she stole all of our materia, and then made us run to Wutai without it, so we were, like, fighting off people just by smacking them with our swords. Um, or fists, or guns, as we were Vincent. Um, we ended up getting it, uh, getting all of our materia back with the help of the Turks. Uh, we threw Don Corneo off a mountain, or Reno did, and that felt kind of therapeutic, I'm not gonna lie. Um, and yeah, that's kind of where we ended. I ended really quickly because, again, I had just massive wisdom tooth pain, and I was a wreck. I was just a very miserable wreck. Oh, you're doing well. I'm glad to hear it. You guys are not already following Latista. Please go ahead and do so. And also, while I'm thinking about stream team stuff, um, the stream team I am very lucky to be a part of. Uh, the Gaming Guild, formerly Club Tortimer. We've opened up applications for new stream team members. If you are a streamer and you are interested in joining, uh, I should probably have the link. I should probably, you know what? Bear with me. Bear with me. Just a second. We'll get it eventually. <laughs> I should probably just have a command. Oh, wait, do I? No, I don't have a command. But I probably should. That would be smart. Alrighty, here is the link. There you go, if you guys would like to join, if you're a fellow streamer. Um, and I think that's pretty much all we gotta know. Um, today, our big thing at the moment, big story beat, is we know Shinra are trying to head towards something called the Temple of the Ancients. And we know that Sephiroth believes he's an ancient and Earth is an ancient. Um, or at least he he used to. He's he's off doing his own thing right now. Um, we also know that um, I think we learned yesterday at least, hopefully. I think I dodged to the right guy. Uh, that someone named Dio has purchased the keystone that you need to get into the temple. Dio is actually the guy who runs the, uh, the gold saucer. So we're going back. It's also date time. It's time to see if I answer correctly to Tifa's 
questions. I think I did. I think I did. I've had I've had surprise dates with Aerith in the past. Which is not bad. I like Aerith. I have nothing against her. But Tifa's my main girl. <laughs> I hope I will. I believe you've been helping me through the affection, so hopefully. Um I don't have any audio, bear with me. There we go. Now I got audio. Um I guess I'll pause that for now. Um, but yeah, this is kind of a fun part of the game before, you know, things go downhill. Um I did mention that I did some grinding. Hi Quick Nova, how are you doing? I did some grinding uh off stream. We have more than enough money to buy the lifetime pass for the gold saucer. Dear lord, the gold saucer is pricey enough as it is. <laughs> Didn't have any oatmeal and I was so confused. I mean, I do, I do not have any oatmeal. That is an accurate fact. Welcome to the gold saucer. Are you together? A single pass is 3,000 gil. Uh, gil. Jill, oh god. Or you can purchase a lifetime pass. 30k. Give me that lifetime pass, please. Thank you very much. If you have a gold ticket, you can come and go freely into the park as long as you don't lose it. Here at the Gold Saucer, there are many places where you must pay with GP. Think of GP as money that you can only use at the Gold Saucer. GP can be redeemed at the games in Wonder Square and at the Chocobo races. So again, that save point up there. That beautiful, beautiful, shiny save point. You, uh, you can't use it unless you have GP. <laughs> It's such a scam. Kirby's cousin Howard? Oh, can't unsee. I would like a lifetime pass to Disney World. Same here. It hurts when you grind for that money for it all to go. As you can see, though, we are not hurting for the Mun Muns. At all. Um, the area I was grinding at, a lot of the enemies after the fight it will drop like two to three K each, so um Universal needs to look into building a Final Fantasy land. Fun fact right. There is somewhere in Japan a Final Fantasy VII themed ride. I'm pretty sure I think it still exists. And I would pay a lot <laughs> to go on it. Hi Faye. Welcome on in. How's your day going? Um uh, okay I think Hopefully this is where we're meant to be. I always get a little bit confused around this time. Oh. oh sorry. Getting a, getting a text message. So here we have Dio's showroom. Uh, and I think that's what we're looking for. It's the keystone. Long time no see, boy. Hmm, you like that, huh? Can you let me borrow this? Sorry, but it's not for rent. Hmm. Since you've been uh, good to me in the past, I can let you have it on one condition. One condition? Entertain me. I'm. I'm just. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. <laughs> Finish kind of grass. Built some garden furniture. Oh, nice! We love that. What does the keystone will look like material in the newer games? I hope not, because it always kind of confused me what it was when I was younger. I'm like, is this like what do I what do I do with it? <laughs> uh, what do I gotta do? Oh boy, nothing all that difficult. This is the battle arena. Show me your fighting skills. Just you, boy. I'm expecting a good fight. Alrighty, so it throws you in here. I already had our materia and everything equipped for this. I don't think I've ever actually gotten through this. It doesn't matter if you win or lose, it's just if you do win, I think you get some stuff. Oh, you know what? That actually worked out very well. I have counterattack materia on. We're in the back row. We got enemy skill. Um, I think I have a restore. Like, we're, we're pretty set. Um, and the way this works is each round that you continue to go on, you will get a, um, a slot wheel. And 
it can break your materia, it can take off your accessories, it can lower your level, it can half your HP, it can do a lot of stuff, it can also do nothing. Magic materia is broken, okay, I don't have any healing. <laughs> um, okay. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. Um, I still have enemy skill though, so good. Um, and when we eventually come back to do this, because this is how we're going to be getting uh, Cloud's ultimate limit, I believe? If not ultimate weapon, I can't remember. Um, you actually want to hit the bad squares because it gives you a multiplier. And like the further you make it through with the more um, negatives, if that makes sense, the higher your score, the better your rewards will be. If that makes sense, you can see the battle points over there. Down five levels. Hi. How are you doing? Ow. Alright, let's keep Aqua longing thing and hope for the best. Oh, you missed me. Ow, you got me that time. <laughs> that was painful. And also, question of the day, if you guys are just joining us and you haven't already heard, uh, would you say that you're fast? At beating video games. And this is a very subjective thing. It's whatever you would consider fast. Oh, armor's broken. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Okay, but that did not take away this yet. Oh, that heal- Oh, God. Whoops! That- that was not intentional. The bit I'm doing on Sandrock I struggle with. Oh, did they make it easier? Maybe I should try trying, actually. I haven't done really trying yet. Let's see. Is this better? Okay, yep. Yeah, that's good. Oh, command. Oh no, that's our enemy skill gone. <laughs> oh no. Oh god, okay. Well, you know what? It's been a pretty good run. Getting all the all the bad things today. Good job, Cloud. Okay, we still have counterattack. <laughs> Maybe they made it easier because people were complaining. Yeah. Come on, Cloud, you can do a counterattack, baby. Oh god, don't miss. Golden Sun, yes! You know what, Buck? I've said this a couple times to a couple different people when they bring it up on stream. It's actually a game that I've had my eye on for a really long time, but I've never gotten around to playing. But I know I'd probably like it. It's just one of those things. It's like I just need to sit down and actually play it. Okay, so I'm gonna heal. I think one of the things is you don't have access to items anymore, so I'd rather stay healed up before we enter a new round. Oh, good job, Cloud. That was actually really good. There we go. Someone basically gods to fight. I love it. I think the most I've seen of it, unfortunately, is uh, speedruns, so I haven't seen, like, you know, the full game. Just kind of rushing through it. Oh, half my MP. Alright, that's fine. I can't use MP anyway. Is it actually coming to the NSO? Is that confirmed? Nice. I know we're all play it then. Honestly, though, friends, if you guys haven't checked out any of the, the, um, the GBA games on NSO, um... I played Minish Cap last year, I think, um, on stream through alternative means. It wasn't on the NSO yet. And then earlier this year, I played it again off stream um, through the NSO, and it's gorgeous. It looks so good. Now, can I have my limit, please? Oh, bless. Meteor Rain. Hey, Laser, how are you? Well, come on in. Oh, 
Yes, yes. Okay, good. That is a lot more doable. That's fine. I can't... I don't have access to magic, so you can block magic all you want, friend. Okay, I need to heal. Good, good, hit it. Okay, missed that one, it's fine. Apparently these things are hard to hit. Ah, there we go. Good, good, okay, one more. Oh, battery... what? Okay, I think it ran out of power of some sort. <laughs> Give half those, why not? Why not? Go ahead. Okay, hi! I am very surprised how far we've made it here. This actually hasn't been too, too bad. hits them all. I think this one has a chance of not hitting some of the targets, but it just does a lot of damage. You'd think his ankle would be sore, yeah. I was thinking the same thing. Okay, wait, wait, wait. I'm going to heal. And then we're going to attack. What next? Item is gone. Okay. We... Mm. Oh, yes. Hello. We screwed, chat. It was nice knowing you. Oh, my God. Ow. No. Now is not the time to be missing. This is painful, friend. Plaid, please. Like I said, I don't think I've ever actually gotten through this. Even with planning. It's over. That was pretty good, though. That was pretty good. We made it pretty far. That's the best you can do. Well, a promise is a promise. Go ahead, take it. So you don't need to win that, but if you do, I think there are, like, items or something that you get. We shall meet again. And there he goes. Valiant try. It was, it was decent. Oh, no, not that. Uh, order. All right, I gotta reset up our characters again. I had them set up a certain way. Uh... Okay, so I had lightning and all. I always just put lightning on cloud. I don't know exactly why. Um, uh, you had the restore, and Vincent because he has cover. He also has the counter attack. Did I have anything here? Death blow, maybe? There we go. That's better. Alrighty, so we got the keystone. Um, I always have trouble navigating to this place, no matter how many times I've played through this game. But pretty much, we're going to be headed for the Temple of the Ancients. This is going to be um, a dungeon where they will force you to use Aerith. Oh, wait. But are we going there quite yet? Excuse me, sir. I'm sorry, the tram is out of order right now. So- <laughs> The cloud's like, so? I'm really sorry. I'm afraid you won't be able to leave until it's fully repaired. What's wrong? Too bad it happens, though. I know, let's stay at the hotel. They know me here. I'll go talk to them. I'll let you know once the repairs are completed.
I don't know if there's really a recommended level. I know I'm a bit overpowered at the moment. Sus, right? We don't usually get the chance to be together like this, huh? Cloud, how about it? Can you tell me what's happened so far? I don't really know what's going on because I wasn't here in the beginning. Yeah, I'm for that. Good idea. I've been here since the beginning and I still don't know what the hell's going on either. Why, what the hell's going on? Come on, tell us. Alright, I'll give it a shot. Hacks <laughs> the game. <laughs> it is very sus, yeah. This is why I grind up airs really high so I don't have to worry about it. Made a mistake of not doing that a few times. Kept on getting my butt beat. Yeah, it's... Like, I managed to get through it my first playthrough without knowing that was coming up, but it was also a bit of a struggle. Oh. We're going after Sephiroth. Sephiroth must be in search of the Promised Land. The Promised Land? A land full of Mako energy, or at least that's what the Shinra believe. I don't know if it actually exists. The Cetra will return to the Promised Land, a land that promises boundless happiness. Etc. That's some kind of disease. Oh my god, Barret. That's what the ancients call themselves. Hey, didn't you listen to the elders at Cosmo Canyon? You don't know where the promised land of the ancients is. You search and travel until you feel it, and you just know that you found it. Aerith, can you feel it too? I think so. So if Sephiroth is traveling the world because he's searching for the promised land, is that it? He's searching for that and one other thing. The Black Materia. I heard from Dio that a man in a black cape was looking for the Black Materia. I've never heard of Black Materia. How many men in, with, or with black capes and number tattoos are there? You know, of course, my tattoo is number 13. How did you get that tattoo? Hojo put it on me. The rest are just war scars, but the number was done by Hojo. So they're at least 13? You know, I think Hojo did something to those men in the black capes. But I don't know what it has to do with Sephiroth, though. So I think we should just go after Sephiroth himself. Yeah, me too. Uh, it's all just too damn confusing. And... I'm sorry, forget it. I think I'm tired. I'm going to bed now. What was that all of a sudden? What, that's it? I'm going to bed. Is that all? How about the black materia? You wouldn't understand even if I told you. <laughs> Cloud with a backlash. All we gotta do is take action. We're starting tomorrow. Cloud. I'm number 13. Am I gonna go mad too? I don't know what Hojo did to you, but you've been alright so far, right? But... Be strong. But I... Stop it, Red 13. Be strong. Tifa? You're not the only one who's worried. I don't know what's going on, but we're in a bad situation. Sid, let's go back to our rooms. Oh, he's just passed out. Oh, hi, Pepper. How you doing? How are you and, and Ben and Lucy and the kitty cats? Hello? Tifa? Yes. <laughs> Sorry. That was a lot. You got some iced coffee here for it. Cloud, what's wrong? I thought uh, about what I was going to say, but it's kind of embarrassing. Hey, Cloud, why don't the two of us sneak out of here and spend some time together? Come on, let's go. <laughs> Cloud's like, uh... <laughs> All right, it's date time, friends. Tonight's nice enchantment night. All the attractions are free. About it, you two. There's going to be an entertaining show in Event Square. Come on, let's go. Congratulations, you are our hundredth couple today. You two will play the leads in tonight's show. What? Oh, now it's not hard. Just play it however you want, and the rest of the cast will cover up for you. All right, chat, I'm going to want some help with this, okay? Come this way. Uh, hey? 
Sounds like fun. Come on, Cloud. Let's give it a try. Pepper, what sort of drink was it? Long, long ago, an evil shadow appeared over the peaceful kingdom of Galdia. Princess Rosa was kidnapped by the evil dragon king, Valvados. What will become of her? Just then, the legendary hero, Alfred, appears. Got it memorized. Oh, I do. I think of Sprite, but like a million times nicer. The only thing I'm coming up with is like a 7-up, but... Oh, you must be the legendary hero, Alfred! Hey, it's your line. Yeah, you. Him. Oh, you must be the legendary hero, Alfred! By, by my soul, please! Please save Princess Rosa! And please talk to the king! Oh, legendary hero Alfred, you have come to save my beloved Rosa! On the peak of a dangerous mountain dwells the evil dragon king Valvados, who's kidnapped Princess Rosa. But you can't beat the evil dragon king now. Talk to the one who can help you. Alright, the knight or the wizard, friends? Just in Denmark. Oh no! Very flavored. Sweets, random hat. Oh, you guys are making me hungry. Night or wizard, friends. Night or wizard. I'm gonna leave this up to you. This can turn really funny. But I want to see what you guys choose. You're a wizard, Crystal. I hope I am. <laughs> You're eating so much. All right, wizard it is. And the great wizard, Mormon. What do you wish to know? The evil dragon's weakness or the princess's measurements, chat. Weakness or measurements. Very important information that we obviously need to know. But which one do we choose? <laughs> Just come to Copenhagen and I'll show you around to you. I'm on my way. Um, weakness? <laughs> ah, the wizard, or the wizard. The weakness of the evil dragon king. It must be, it must be. Yes, it must be true love. The power of love is the only weapon that can withstand the fangs of the evil dragon king. But what's gonna happen next? Oh, legendary hero, look. The evil Dragon King Valvados, I have not harmed the princess, I have been expecting you. Please help me, legendary hero. How was that? Here I come, legendary hero Alfred. I already know your name. Now, legendary hero, here's what will happen to your beloved. A kiss of power, the power of true love. Chat. <laughs> Do I kiss the princess? Do I kiss the king? Or do I kiss the evil dragon king? <laughs> oh god. I can't remember... I think last time we we messed this up as well. Not messed up. There isn't a way to mess it up. It's just... Funny. Go for the princess. You guys are playing it so safe. But I do get to kiss my girl. On the hand. Cloud, I mean Alfred. Ugh, curses the power of love. I love that his feet, <laughs> his feet stay. You're gonna kiss Jesse here on your birthday. Oh. oh, don't, don't. Oh, behold, love has triumphed. Now let's all return and celebrate. Yes, let's. And we spin on stage. <laughs> Oh, Happer found the power of love, and so the legendary hero Alfred and our story live on happily ever after. Here we go. So we actually did it the right, the right way. There's funny alternatives, but I'm here for it. Um, no, it's funny. Hey, let's go on the gondola next. This is cute as heck, by the way. Know how to fight and do ballet. <laughs> Two, please. Here you are. Two tickets. 
which are the sites of the gold saucer. So we can like look around. It's very cute. Without fail, these noises always remind me of like Roller Coaster Tycoon, like OG. Me, I'm very twitchy. <laughs> I tend to move around a lot, even if I'm trying to sit still, so. It's a chocobo racing. It's really pretty, isn't it? Okay, I'm gonna just go ahead and say it. What? Ares would uh, be able to just come out and say it, probably. Cloud? Sometimes being old friends is hard. I mean, timing is everything. Yeah. Cloud? I... Oh, gosh darn it. <laughs> Tifa, just say it. Just say it, girl. Thought I really had fun tonight. By the way, what did you want to say a minute ago? Nothing. Nothing. Oh, look at the time. We should be getting back. So, that was the date scene. Um, depending on how you speak to the characters or interact with them uh, during the game leading up to this point, you can go on dates with uh, Tifa, Aerith, Yuffie, and Barret. Um, Tifa is, is, is cute, but she doesn't really say anything. I think Aerith kind of, if you know the story, she goes on a bit about wanting to meet the real Cloud, which we'll go into later. Um, Yuffie actually does kiss Cloud on the cheek, and Barret shoots at the fireworks. And that's all I know. I haven't actually seen the Barret one or the Yuffie one in person, actually. I've only ever seen the other two. That's... Kate Sith, he's acting strange. Oh, there's the keystone I just earned. Is that the keystone? Hey, Kate Sith. Or catch she or whatever your name is. The Barrett one is apparently very funny. Yeah, I've seen clips of it. Oh, 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 there we go. Oh, you bud. I went back in. I'm used to exiting out the left side. Or do it. Join me. Hey, over here. Well done. And the keystone is now in Shinra's hands. Hey! Oh, wait a second. I won't run or hide. Yes, I was a spy. I was hired by the Shinra. Don't mess with us. I couldn't help it. How about if we go on like nothing ever happened? No way, cat. You got a lot of guts acting like a friend, but being a spy. Then what are you gonna do? Kill me? Just be wasting your time if you try This body's just a toy anyway. My real body's at Shinra headquarters in Midgar. I'm controlling this toy cat from there. So you're from Shinra. Who are you? Well, I can't tell you my name. Not getting anywhere. See, I told you. Talking won't do any good. So can't we just continue our journey? You think I'm joking? 
Alright, yes, I am a Shinra employee, but we're not entirely enemies. Something bothers me. I think it's your way of life. You don't get paid, you don't get praised, yet you still risk your lives and continue on your journey. See, that makes me... It just makes me think about my life. I don't think I'd feel too good if things ended the way they are now. I'm lying again. I'll never tell the truth. Once a spy, always a spy. We can't go on uh, with someone like that. Come on, get real. Just as I thought, talking won't make a bit of a difference. But I prepared something in case this happened. Why don't you listen to this? Papa? Tifa? Marlene? It's Tifa. Tifa, help. I'm... So you have to do as I say. You're the lowest. I didn't want to do this using dirty tricks and taking hostages. But this is how it is. No compromises. So why don't we go on as we did? Tomorrow's the Temple of the Ancients, right? I know where it is, so I'll tell you later. Of course, we'll get there after the Shinra, but you'll have to deal with that. Well, we're stuck. We'll have to do what he says. Marlene. So again, Marlene is uh, Barrett's daughter. She was apparently with uh, Eris adoptive mom. We left her uh, with her pretty early on in the game. Are you going designed the helicopter. It's been a good few years, to be honest. It's a good time. I feel like it's a great time to get back into Final Fantasy or into it for the first time. What took you so long, Cloud? Oh yeah, about the Temple of the Ancients. I think if we take the tiny Bronco East towards the sea, we should be able to find it. Well then, shall we get going? Who's gonna go? I wanna go. I'm going for sure. Alrighty. You know, we have to- we have to keep Tifa with us. That is mandatory. Um, that being said... We gotta do some... It's so handy that I have this now. <laughs> I gotta do some swapping of materia here. There we go. The hotel is gonna look really cool. I hope that they stick with the, the like, spooky theme, too. Um... Okay, so... Let me take a look here, because steel is one thing. I don't think you need cover and counterattack. Ice is fine. Um, she can take the enemy skill, I guess. And Rama. Um, Wait, no, it was counter and cover, wasn't it? There we go. Okay. Um, so here's the enemy skill. Just all the summons, why not? Uh, cool. Oh, and also, you know what else I'm going to do as well? Uh, I'll show you guys here. We have finished leveling up Aeris Limit. So again, um, I didn't do it on... on stream on camera but for those who are maybe playing through with me or playing through with me in the future um the first level so uh breath of earth for example the first thing in level two um i need to use that a certain amount of times before i unlock the second thing which is fury brand um after i get to that second thing i can't unlock level three until i've killed off a certain amount of enemies each character i think has a different amount um, so I did all that grinding off stream. Um, level four is a little different because you're gonna get a, um, an item for each of the characters in various ways. We already have one for, I think that's for Red 13, and we have one for Eris. So I'm gonna give Eris hers. There we go. I don't think I have any of the other ones yet. No. So... I need to go in and change it to level four. She is set. Uh, I think we're gonna get her ultimate weapon as well in the um, uh, what am I thinking of? In the Temple of the Ancients coming up here. I think. Can I not go in the shop right now? Really? I've never tried to do that. <laughs> well, and see you later.
But yeah, no, I, I always, like, I was actually explaining it to Mike earlier. He was watching me do some grinding, and he's like, why bother? Um, like, why why bother if, if you're not really going to use her, you know? And I'm like, it just kind of, it's nice. It's just nice, okay? <laughs> There's no benefit uh, unless, you know, you, you decide to use her in your party. Uh, but it's also handy because, again, she is forced to be with you for this section, so... Rebecca, no words. I was wondering when you were gonna get started on your on your, uh, on your laundry. God, I hate doing laundry, but I love that like couple days after, where it's like, yes, I don't need to do it for a while. I most of our weapons for sure. I get all of them. Usually make Tifa OP. Gotten in a good habit. Yeah, doing it in the time slot. I was actually talking to Mike about it, because again, I don't think he was here when you were explaining it. Um, but it's neat that you get to, like, have a certain time slot. On your fourth lot? Yeah, I know after vacation as well, it's like, ah, oh, I have so much to catch up on. Um, Alright, so we are going to go back towards Nibelheim. That's actually where the tiny Bronco is at the moment. Alright, um... There's... There we go. This is a little overkill. <laughs> So since we have her weapons, that's the end of the game, right? Yes, absolutely. That's that's the end. That's that's all she wrote. For disc one. For disc one. Hey, Teddy. Boyfriend and I are playing Tears of the Kingdom, so I'm just saying hey for now. I hope you enjoy. Thank you so much for coming in to say hi. And have fun. I I've been loving that game in the evening, friends. I am so excited to stream it. But I also know it'll be good for me to like finish it and then take a little bit of a break from it. As much as I want to just be like, no, we're starting it tomorrow. Even though I kind of don't, because I'm also really enjoying Final Fantasy. <laughs> They're empty from websites, so that's why I'm going down there a bit early. The previous person already emptied it. So we had that for a little while. There's an app I have on my phone that I use for laundry and I can like pay from the app. Um, and for a long time it worked perfectly where I could check ahead of time if, like, how busy the laundry room was. <clears throat> um, but the app hasn't been working recently. It just says they're all available when they're not, and it kind of sucks. Ah, oh, thank you. Yeah, it's a... God, it's going to be a really big playthrough when we eventually do get to it. The game's far too big for its own good. Twitch, could you not? Is Twitch acting up? Do I have to fight someone? I'll fight someone. Okay, so somewhere around here. I left the tiny Bronco yesterday. We'll see if I remember where it was. Oh god, these guys again. Um... Uh, actually, no. Do you try and... But Pepper, I get that. We um we did laundry the other day on one of my days off, and um we were washing a mattress protector that really really needed it. Um hasn't been washed in a very long time, and um it didn't get fully. Or, wait, it wasn't... We couldn't put it in the dryer. It needed a certain setting that our dryers don't have. So we put it outside, and in my head, I'm just like... I'm gonna have such bad allergies. <laughs> but it dried very quickly, at least. Okay, so here's the tiny Bronco. Um, I always found it a bit weird that this game doesn't have water battles. A lot of other Final Fantasies did. Uh, and I'm just gonna... Bear with, let me see if I remember what button it. There we go. We're gonna open up the map. I always have a bit of a 
time navigating because again we can only stick to the shallows here um but i'm gonna try my best to get there quickly feel dumb internet's not been working for like a day there was an outage i just had to oh thought there was an outage you just had to reset the router oh no or rest it even been issue for a while now it really sucks it does it'd be nice to just not have to worry about it I mean yeah I was thinking it was pretty much the same thing just giving it a moment Every now and then, Mike is like, yeah, we should just, like, turn off the the router for five minutes. Give it a second. Oh, God. Okay, wait. No, I think I need to be up. <laughs> okay, so this is uh, a place we're going to be going to pretty soon here. Probably this afternoon, I'm guessing. Or earlier. Uh... God, I think it's this way. You know what? We get to enjoy the overworld music while I figure out my way. <laughs> uh, no. That's calm. Oh man, that's a mood though. <laughs> All the brain farts. Gonna be a lot of emotions today. Yes, indeedy. Okay, I think we're coming up for it here. If I'm remembering where it is correctly. Uh, oh, we're going to be in that cave later. Much, much later, mind you, but we'll get there eventually. Wait a minute. Is it this one? Uh, yes. Okay, so that's where we're going. I went around the wrong way somehow. Oh dear. Did I completely go the wrong way? Oh, how do I always manage this? Okay. Can I go around from... Do I need to cut through here oh i i played this game in january i beat this game again in january on the ps5 i should know this but i really never ever remember okay so apologies for the overlay um we're trying to get to the little little itty bitty island that's just like off um from the big one that we're next to. I say itty bitty, it's not actually that small, but... Welcome back, Rebecca. Oh, here we go, here we go, here we go. Okay, yes, I remembered that you need to go through... Like, harshly this area. Ta-da, we made it! See, it wasn't that bad. It didn't take five years, we're fine. Um, I'm gonna give people the heads up here as well. This is mainly for people who might be playing through alongside me in the future or even right now. Um, before you go in here, if it's your first playthrough and you don't really know what to expect, it might be a good idea to do a save in another slot. Because when you enter here, you can't really come back out until you're done. And... You, you don't want to get stuck. So. I feel, I'm feeling pretty confident. I don't think we're going to get stuck. But. Just to give you that little heads up. This is the Temple of the Ancients. I know. I feel it. The knowledge of the Ancients floating. 
could become one with the planet, but you're stopping it with the strength of will for the future, for us. What are you saying? Do you understand? So there's going to be a lot of Aerith kind of talking or listening to the planet or to ancients here. Um, I find some of this dialogue is unfortunately really poorly translated as well, but you're uneasy but happy. Because I'm here. I'm sorry, I don't understand. I want to go inside. Why is she lying on the ground? She's just... She's having a moment. Black Syria. Oop. Look. Number nine, another man with a tattoo. There he goes. Yeah, I think this is going to be a much bigger section for remake. Hey, it's Song. Song of the Turks? Oh, I've been tricked. It's the promised land Sephiroth's searching for. Sephiroth, he's inside? Look for yourself. Damn. Letting Aerith go was the start of my bad luck. The president was wrong. You are wrong. Promised Land isn't like what you imagined. And I'm not going to help. By the way, there was no way Shinra could have won. Pretty harsh. Sounds like something you'd say. The keystone. Place it on the altar. There we go. We got it back. Crying? Songs with our enemy, the Turks, but I've known him since we were little. Uh, you no, know, he was much older than her. I'm just gonna put that out there. He was pretty much an adult when they first met. Weird translation. There's not a lot of people I can say that about. In fact, there are probably only a handful of people in the world who really know me. Yep, so there's one of those other ones. Anyway, he's still alive. He 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 kind of twitches every now and then. He'll be. I'm probably let's put the keystone in. Yeah, I would agree. I would agree, affection. I'm I'm so excited to see how they handle that. All right, you guys know those paintings where it's like infinite stairs and, and walkways that like interconnect but they don't make any sense. We're pretty much playing through one right now. Words feeling so many of them here. What a strange place. Do you think we're welcome here? Cloud, I know it's going to be tough, but don't give up. We can do it. Alrighty, so welcome on in. Um... No matter how many times I play this, I always forget my directions. So bear with me. It's just going to be me kind of wandering for a while. There are some goodies that we do want to pick up in here. This is the only time you can come in. If you miss it, you're screwed. Um, so. I'm going to take my time. Try to get everything. Nice, level up, nice. Been leveling up a lot of materia, I feel like, this playthrough. Also, sometimes it's not very obvious, like, where you can go up and down. Or what you can go under, and it's just... It's a lot. Trident, that is something at four. Uh... Or Sid, I think. Okay, there are froggy friends? Those guys can be very annoying. Oh god, okay. That's fine. You know- Ah, you know what? We haven't seen Odin yet. Why not?
He has a pretty cool animation, though. Look at that. Yeah, he was riding one of Loki's children. <laughs> we just gotta go on and pretend we did not perceive. Yeah, 16's definitely gonna be a lot more about the summons, which is gonna be fun. Cool. Oh, okay. Don't go in there yet. Seal, that sounds bring or that sound brings back memories for some reason. Lord knows why. Mind source. All right, so we gotta take a little peek in here. Hi. Yum yum. <laughs> They're so cute. Oh, we finally caught up to you. I'm sorry you waited for me. Uh, those are the spirit bodies of the ancients. They've been away from their planet for a long time to protect this temple. Over many years, they've lost the ability to talk. Actually, they didn't need words in the beginning because there was only one objective for those left in the temple. Please talk to me. No good, I don't understand the rest. Are you afraid? It's because Sephiroth is in the temple or something else? Uh, that is... Oh, right. I don't have... <laughs> I don't have Vincent with me. That is probably for Vincent. Um... Let me rest. There we go. And I'm gonna do a save here and again. This is the Temple of the Ancients. You won't be able to go back easily. Is that all right? So again, if you have the option, save in a different slot. I don't really mind. I think we're gonna be fine. But um, just you know, play, play things safe. It's one of those older games that kind of can be kind of ruthless in that regard. So I know that there is something in particular that we want in here, but I don't think it's something we can actually get uh, this early. There's a very, very good um, accessory, I think it is. Oh, wait a minute. Have I gone the right way? No, oh, that's back the way we came. Okay, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Okay, you're down there. How do I get down there again? Go through. This is gonna be very trippy in remake. Uh... Oh dear. Oh no, not the froggies. <laughs> not the froggies. I'll send Odin out again. Don't make me. That's just, that's just cool. We're all leveled up. How do I get back down? Wait a minute. I'm missing something silly here. Uh, is it? There we go. That's what I'm looking for. way this way okay here we go um and something else we're not gonna see it for a little while here but we're getting closer is that something for tifa no okay um materia in this game when you fully level it up it will birth a new materia so essentially if i finish leveling up 
and all materia, it will be maxed out and I get to keep it. But it will also give me a brand new all materia. So by the end of the game, you're going to have a lot of duplicate materia, which is handy. You have a lot of different party members. Um, all materia, when it's maxed out, sells for a lot. <laughs> it sells for a heck of a lot. Um, I go in here. Why does it let me go here? Oh, here we go. That's where I want it. So every time I see all level up, I get a little bit excited because we do want the sweet, sweet mum buns. Holy genie, how is your day going? Uh, luck plus. That's nice. I'll leave it for now. I don't think we really need it at the moment. Jeez, Tifa. <laughs> Wait a minute, is it Aerith in the back row? No, what am I doing? Girl, you're meant to be back there. Um, okay, so we're going down here. I think that chest right there we're gonna come back and get later. We do come back out here for a second. Some coffee, now I'm ready to get some cleaning done. A few chickens. Oh, and a couple of rabbits! Oh my goodness! I hope that you have a good, uh, a good time cleaning. Here we are on the inside. Um, oh. There's gonna be this little mini game ish where you have to avoid. Oh god. Avoid being crushed. I usually don't have any trouble with this. Oh my god. Ow. Alright. I can. Oh god. Ow. Okay. Nope, that didn't go well. It, oh, help. Okay. It doesn't actually hurt you. I thought it did. Okay. We can do this, I believe. One. Two. Three. Oh, it's that one where I get stuck. this one and go under that one first maybe two three there we go that was the order fourth material we'll use that later uh and now i gotta do it again <laughs> usually have no trouble with that and apparently this time it was just not going to happen oh we did it everyone all right that was rough oh no cloud come quick hurry this way It's full of the knowledge of the ancients. No, not knowledge. Consciousness, a living soul. It's trying to say something. Sorry, I don't understand. What? What is it? Speaking of what is it, it's Sentry coming in with the 25 month Lurking resub. while fighting all the demons in the world. Hello, Tilda. 
Hello, Tilda, to you as well, Sandra. I hope that you're having fun. Thank you so, so very much for the 25 month resub. If we could get some hype, some love in chat, that would be beautiful. Welcome on in. Danger and evil consciousness. Show, you're gonna show me? What's going on? Wait, look, it's showing us. Sun, what is this? Can we find the promised land with this? I wonder. Anyway, we have to report to the president. Be careful, Sung. Yeah. Hey, Elena, how about dinner after this job's over? Uh, thank you very much. If I may be excused. I ship it. Is this the promised land? No, it can't be. Oh. Sephiroth. Let's go open the door. Well done. This place, what is it? A lost treasure house of knowledge, the wisdom of the ancients. I'm becoming one with the planet. One with the planet. Stupid fools, you've never even thought about it. All the spirit energy of the planet, all its wisdom, knowledge. I do not know what Seth's doing here. He's just kind of having a moment. I'll meld with it all. I'll become one with it. It will become one with me. You can do that? The way lies here. The death awaits you all, but do not fear. For through death, the new spirit energy is born. Soon you will live again as a part of me. Hey, Ace, how are you doing? Welcome on in. How's your day treating you so far? Did you see it? I saw it. Where's the room with the pictures on the wall? Almost there. Sephiroth is here, right? No matter what he thinks, it's going to end here. Taking him out. We're here too, you know. Alright, I would just like to stop here and take a moment because this always makes me laugh. He just sits there and kind of like vibes in the hot tub that is the ancient like, spirit. He's, he's literally having a hot tub stream right now. It's not even against TOS anymore. Oh, you said you want to sleep in a little. Seth needs a reality check, honestly. It would save so much hassle and drama. Uh, okay, we're gonna do a rest. So why not? And we're gonna save. So again, why not? Alrighty, welcome on into the clock puzzle. This is weird. Uh, I am the time guardian. Ye who seek the knowledge of the ancients, I control time. Select your path. Alright, so. Um. There's no point in having it randomly spin. So, hit menu. Um. And pretty much what I'm gonna be doing. Oh, wait a minute. Um. Uh, is using the hands of the clock to get around uh, and check out the various rooms. I never remember what's in each room. So we're just gonna check them all. That is nothing. Okay, good. But myself. I think 12 might not be where we want to be later yes <laughs> spooky room you tend to skip past this bit i just know that there's like there's goodies in here you know i gotta get me my goodies okay 
now some of these chests are mimics essentially yeah that one was it's gonna have a pretty lady in it and some frogs apparently why were the frogs there i don't know we don't ask questions don't worry about it i stop feeling so hungry oh mood pepper same I've been getting the habit of not eating in the mornings, really. I'll have liquids, but no food until around lunchtime. And uh, it's around this time where I start to get very hungry. <laughs> yeah, you kind of have to reset back almost to... Um, how you were before. I know that's a struggle, but I know you can do it too. Oi, Andrew, how are you? Welcome on in. Nope, that's a dead end already. And also, friends, question of the day, if anyone has an answer or would like to chime in. Um, do you tend to beat games quickly? Like, what do you consider how fast you beat games fast? It's a very personal thing, because what may be fast for someone might not be for another. I go very slow. <laughs> Oh my god, just eyeball jellos. Yummy. My speed is snail pace. <laughs> do you guys... Do you guys have to do that? Ow. Didn't even get my level or my limit fully up. Sometimes I just play and beat them pretty quickly, like Jack and Daxter I can beat in a single day. First, like, Cooper I got for Christmas. Yeah, and then you beat it that day, yeah. Yeah, there are definitely some games. I find if I know the game, if I'm replaying through it, I'll go a lot faster. Um, but if I'm just playing for the first time, I'll, I'll go pretty slow. Parts day, I have reserved. Rock design with my tattoo artist. Haven't said a day yet. Oh, exciting! That's gonna be fun. Then there's Persona. No matter what I'm doing, run always takes a hundred hours. Yes, I like. I really want to stream Persona one day, but I also really, really don't because it will be a very, very long playthrough. Right, I know it doesn't seem like there's been anything good in here so far, but I promise. There's something very good in here. That's for Era. That's for our girl. Raises power when you need to protect others nearby. That is her ultimate. That is a very, very good weapon <laughs> for her. Yeah, East changed their username. I know we were, we were going on about it the other day. Okay, here we go. So this is going to be the ribbon. The ribbon, if you've played any Final Fantasies before, is very, very nice. <laughs> the ribbon protects, protects against pretty much all status effects. Um, eventually, I'd love to get one on each character. There are ways and means to do that. Um, it is just pretty much one of the best things you can throw on a character in this game for accessories. Unless you're going for something very specific. Isn't it cute? You do need a peanut butter jar, Emo. 
Now, Ace, I can't remember if I've asked. Does, uh, does Zoe like peanut butter? I feel like most dogs probably do. You have the Zoe emotion. Trumpet shell, I think that's for Kate Sith. Yes, she does. Oh, perfect. Now, I skipped over uh, the bottom one. I think it'd be six, by the way, because we're actually going to be going there. Um, next, I think. Or soon. It's going to be where we're meant to go. Does falling actually get you something, Imagine? I don't think I've ever fallen. <laughs> Does it really? Wait a minute. What? I have fell, can confirm. <laughs> I'm gonna go fall off now. <clears throat> um... How does one? Hey, how does one fall? I need to fall. Let me off. Let me off. Okay, wait. Maybe if I go here and this hits me. I was telling my husband I want a Zoe PNG for like Tater. You should get one, honestly. Oh, I don't think I've ever done this. There's a dinosaur in this room. I've never been here. <laughs> this atmosphere. Here it comes. Oh, oh, we fighting? Oh, hi. It was a first time for everything, chat. This is cool. Okay, let's try finishing touch. I was you came back. I was so confused. That's so funny. Okay, yeah, there we go. Uh, Eric, you can just hang out for a second here. I don't think these guys have that much HP. Hi, random. How are you? Gosh, she does quite a bit of damage here. Heck yeah. There we go. Yes, yes I have, Pepper. Um, for you or anyone else in chat, you can do exclamation mark mods. Um, the backgrounds are one mod that just makes everything look so much better, dear lord. Uh, and the characters themselves are a different mod. Um, and just together, I think they look great. Or mode. You know, that's, <laughs> that's a thing too. That's where you get the nail bat for- I've never- it doesn't have material slots, does it? No, it doesn't, but it does hit pretty hard. I didn't know where you got that from. Where does it let you out? Where? Oh, 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 okay. Today I did, I did some learning chat. No, it, it is much more crispy normally. I love the joke weapons. Yeah, they're cute. They are cute. Oop. All right. Thankfully, we don't got to do the rock thing again. We can just run right through. You know what? Even more chance to rest and more chance to save. I don't turn down free healing. Mr. the AC in the cabin, yeah. Uh, okay, so we're gonna move everything forward here. Uh, I think I've done eight. I think we're moving on to nine. Might not have anything, mind you, but let's see. Oh, 
We got everything. We good. Uh, all right, move it myself. Go back in time. There we go. So we're going to go down to six here. This is going to be where we are going. There's a strat for this. And I'll be darned if I know what it is. Um, long story short, he's going to enter in one thing, enter out another, or exit out another. He has a key. Uh, we need to catch up to him, but we don't know... If we enter through one hole, we don't know where we'll exit from, if that makes sense. Oh, does Zoe got a little bone this morning? Maybe I should change my name. <laughs> I mean, Rebecca, maybe. Some people are chill with it. I'm pretty sure there is... Always starting the love. I'm pretty sure there is a strat for this. This is a Mario Party minigame. It is, too, yeah. Just hang in there. Cindy will look back on these hard times and laugh. Oh, girly. The guard that escaped the key to the door moves on a set course. Memorize the doors he enters and exits to figure out the pattern and catch him at an exit. Uh, you can jump down to the ramp below and to the left of the screen. I always keep on wanting to change my name, but I can't think of something else. Gets buried under her toys and she gets excited and finds it again. Oh, that's cute. I'm gonna look this up actually and see if there is like a set thing I can do. Because I think I saw 4 8 Productions do this. Um, let's see, seven. Temple of the Ancients. Um, door puzzle? Get that key. DS, I'm good. How are you? Yeah, I gotta cut him off, pretty much. Um, okay. I'm pretty sure there's a way to one-shot this. To bear with, bear with. We do be looking at the guides. So I think if I go down, bear with me. I think he'll come out of this one. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> there is a way to cheese it if you know where he's going to exit out of. So I have to remember that. I probably won't, but... Do another save. Oh yeah, no, like I am such a believer in in guides. If it makes your gameplay experience better, you know. Work well, wow, that sounds like something for Tifa. Oh, this is another one of the jerk weapons though, isn't it? Or at least it doesn't have material slots, which I like. Um, secure. Hope I didn't miss anything. Zero ideas, that's probably not gonna happen. I'm very comfortable and happy with the simply press start name. Um, gosh darn it. <laughs> so I'm kind of happy I don't ever have the, the desire to change it. Rosie, what board game you got? Bear with, I'm I'm lost. Gosh darn it. You have to let me out eventually, game. Aha, there we go. <laughs> Jeez. Um Depends on how I want to approach the game. For two seconds, I'm taking my time exploring with Mario Kart 8. I'm in and out as fast as possible. <laughs> it's called Flamecraft. Blue can recommend it to you. Oh, cool. Let us know how it is. Uh, so we do have a little fight coming up here. Uh, you don't have an accessory on, Curly. What are you doing? Oh god, does it do fire? I can't remember. I'm gonna have that on just in case, because I feel like there's something to do with fire here. 
This is the room with the murals. Where are you, Sephiroth? Oh. So cold. I'm always by your side. Come. Well. No more dragon bells. I need to hire them to cute little shops. Little, little baker or cafe. One has the most hired dragons wins. Oh, it's happening. Oh, it's going down. It'll happen soon. It's a lot of video games like to complete. Like lots of side stuff. Yeah. That's what's keeping me entertained with Tears of the Kingdom at the moment. It's just all the side stuff. <laughs> Splendid. The treasure house of knowledge. Oh, thank you for the follow. I don't understand what you're saying. Look well. At what? But that which adds the knowledge of... I'm becoming one with the planet. Uh, without spoiling too much, Rosie, I'll say... Not really. I'm sorry, I'm trying to avoid it, but... We'll see him properly later. Soon we will become one. Gosh darn it, Seth. How do you intend to become one with the planet? Simple. Once the planet is hurt, it gathers spirit energy to heal the injury. The amount of energy gathered depends on the size of the injury. What would happen if there's an injury that threatened the very life of the planet? Think how much energy would be gathered. And at the center of that injury will be me. All that boundless energy will be mine. By merging with all the energy uh, of the planet, I will become a new life form, a new existence. Melding with the planet, I will cease to exist as I am now, only to be reborn as a god, to rule over every soul. An injury powerful enough to destroy the planet. Injure the planet? Hold that mural, the ultimate destructive magic meteor. That'll never happen. Oh, wake up. Where are you, Sephiroth? Wait, Cloud. Cloud? Hey, Cloud? He's... He's okay. He'll be fine. <laughs> Black Materia! <laughs> uh, call Meteor. Cloud, get a hold of yourself! Cloud? I'm Cloud. How should I... I remember, I remember my way. Cloud? What's wrong? Is something wrong? It's nothing, so don't worry about it. I want them to make it very creepy. In, uh... In Rebirth, or wherever this is gonna be shown. Just, like, have this be a very, very dark room. Oh, it's gonna be great. Right, Cloud? It's nothing. Sephiroth got away. Don't worry about it. I understood what he was saying. So this must be Meteor, right? Is something gonna fall from the sky? This must be magic. Just what Sephiroth was saying. The ultimate destructive magic Meteor. Find small drifting planets with its magic. And then collides with them. This planet might get wiped out entirely. Sephiroth? Uh, it's not me. I love this. He's like, it wasn't me this time.
Oh, okay. Hello! Okay, this is why I remember there being fire. How are you doing? Do you have anything... ...interesting that I should know about? Do you have anything to steal? No, you don't. All right, cool. Oh, God. Okay, ow. First off. <laughs> that was painful. Second, put on big guard. Oh, this song's so good. There's hardly a day I don't listen to the remake version of this song now. They did such a phenomenal job with it. I still love the OG, but remake is also just very good. It's like its own thing. fire. We don't want that. There we go. This wasn't too bad. Ooh, counter attack level up. I like that. Dragon armlet. Dye my roots peaking purple night before we went away. Because the sun, they are now really pink. I'll have to go over them when I can be arsed. Oh no, Pepper! That's so frustrating. I've been waiting for my hair to get lighter because I haven't dyed it in a while. Um, and my hair used to get sun bleached very easily, but it hasn't happened yet. It looks darker than it did before, almost. Any sign of Sephiroth? He disappeared. Materia. Oh, Bahamut. What is this? There's something written on it. Black Materia. Black Materia? Hey. Black Materia. What should we do? Um. Uh, Alright, take it. Oh god, okay, don't take it. <laughs> Lucy's gone such a pretty brown in the sun. She has like golden bits, yeah. Never dyed my hair. Had to completely bleach it first. I was a bit worried. I was initially thinking of trying to go really vibrant purple at one point, um, but I didn't want to bleach it, so it went kind of just like a very dark color. And then before that, I was dyeing it a much more vibrant red, but again, without bleach. Um, and that's kind of slowly coming out. Wait a minute, I'll ask. I don't understand. What? Really? They said that the temple itself is the black materia. What do they mean? So this whole building is the black materia? This huge temple, this is the black materia? Then no one could take it. It's pretty hard. You see, this is a model of the temple, and inside it is a device which gets smaller each time you solve a puzzle. As the model becomes smaller, you become smaller too. Until it's small enough to fit in the palm of your hand. But if we solve the puzzles, the black material will get smaller and smaller and we can take it out. Yes, but there's one thing. You can only answer the puzzles inside the temple. So anyone who solves the puzzles would be crushed by the temple. This is where I'd dye my hair if I had any- Low key. I'm gonna put out there. I won't spoil where or when. I will say it's side content in Tears of the Kingdom. Someone says that. I would- this is where I'd put my blank if I had any. And I was like, oh my god, I took a screenshot of it. I found a meme all on my own. I'd have to bleach if I want to color it to anything, so you just leave it the way it is, yeah. Ah, I see. The ancients didn't want dangerous magic to be taken out of the temple so easily. Let's just leave it, okay? No, we've got to think of a way to get it out. Because Sephiroth has lots of different flunkies. It's nothing to him to throw their lives away to get the black materia. This place isn't safe. So, what are we gonna do?
Apparently we have cell phone reception. Hi Cloud, this is Kate Sith. Or Kat Chi, or however you want to say my name. I overheard the whole story. Don't forget about me. Everything you said makes perfect sense. You can use my stuffed body for the future of the planet. We can't let Sephiroth get his hands on the Black Materia, and we can't let the Shinra get theirs on it either. But Cloud, there's really nothing else you can do. Ron, please trust me, I guess we have no choice. Alrighty then, leave it all to me. Please hurry, you've got to get out of here. I'll be waiting at the exit. Alrighty, so again, we found out earlier, story-wise, that, uh... Ketchy, Kate Sith, Cat Sith, however you want to say his name, the uh, cat riding a moogle that we've never ever used as a party member unless you can avoid it. Um, or unless you can't avoid it, sorry. Um, was a Shinra spy. We don't know who's operating him, at least story-wise at the moment. Um, but it's someone from Shinra who is in Midgar currently. That's what we know. Um, and he seems like he's kind of trying to play both sides. He doesn't quite want to be against us, but also he still needs to work for Shinra. Um, we don't we don't trust him at all right now. From my couple of purple hair stints, I've just had different shades of brown hair. All right, hi again. Can I have a rest and another save? Wouldn't you believe it? I'm hoping we can get Aerith to have a limit here. I don't think she's had... I just want to see it, you know? I earned it. I may as well actually use it. It's warm. This isn't good. Cloud behind you? We got a wall fight. Another, I feel like Final Fantasy staple. Um, uh, I don't remember if you have any set weaknesses, or if it's just kind of smacky with whatever we got and hope for the best. Finding a wall, a real gamer moment. <laughs> Ever just had a wall get in your way and you're just like, man, I wish I could fight that. But that does not do much damage at all, does it? Oh, are you making some coffee? I hope you enjoy. Come on, I want to see Eris Limit. And the wall is tired of heavy controllers thrown at it. You don't have anything to steal, do you? No. Okay. Cool. Oh, um, actually. No, not that. Put that back on, just for safety. Also, Mike's currently... He's either just arriving home or on his way home. hurt quite a bit more if I didn't have a uh, barrier on. You know what though? I had so much trouble with the wall boss in I think it was Final Fantasy 12. It, it actually did make me stop playing. <laughs> I was like, no, no. Oh, <gasps> did you just knock out my girl? Excuse me. Hello, please stop. That hurts. Okay, that's- that's really not nice, friend. Like, that's incredibly rude. Okay, don't attack us. There we go. Good. Uh... 
worry about bolts. Uh, you have cure too. That sounds like a good idea. What summons do? Oh, we have quite a few here. Have we seen Rama yet? Could have we seen Rama yet? No worries, Rebecca. I hope it goes well. I did want to see- oh, there he is, there he is. I was gonna say, I do want to see Rama, but the, the wall's kind of in the way. Oh, that did, like, nothing. Okay. Good to know. Can you hit Aerith one more time, please? Just once more. Perfect. Get to actually see her great gospel. Uh, this is her final limit. I wanted to make sure we at least saw it. That's pretty fancy. You gotta admit, that's that's very fancy. to how much damage everything's been doing. Uh, I'm better off just physically attacking you. Yeah, that's a very pretty limit. Also, she made us briefly invulnerable or invincible. I think that's probably the right word. Oh, gosh darn it, Zoe. Zoe's like, you gotta pay attention to me. I'm more important. Joke weapon. Oh, okay. Taking this without a defense thingy. Oh, you. Well, I just caught his limit. That could have been a cool ending. Okay, either way. It was still very neat. to keep you waiting it's me i'll handle the rest well everyone take care of yourselves kate shit <laughs> kate shit i didn't mean that but it just kind of that happened come on cloud say something i'm not good at this mm, i understand i feel the same too that's his canon name now <laughs> Why don't you read our fortunes? Say, that's right, I haven't done it in a while, huh? I'm so excited, right or wrong, I'm still the same old me. Now, what should I predict? Mm, let's see how compatible Cloud and I are. This is another thing where it's like, Aerith, Tifa is right there. Aerith, no! <laughs> oh, no. That'll cost you exactly one date. What is that? Does he... How did he know about that? <laughs> I hate this part. I always found it way out of Aerith's character. Yeah. I ship it? No. <laughs> Poor Tifa. This isn't good. I can't say it. Poor Tifa. No, tell me. I promise I won't get mad, Aerith. It's not you who were worried about, sweetheart. Is that so? Then I'll tell you. Looks good, you're perfect for each other. Air star and cloud star, they show a great future. Cloud, I'll be your matchmaker preacher. I'll do whatever you want me to. Just call me when it all happens. I have theories on this, but I can't talk about it until later. <laughs> Thank you for believing in me, knowing that I was a spy. This is the final, final farewell. Be strong. I just, just, just go on. Just, just go. She told me to be strong. I feel so happy. Ow.
I think this is meant to make you feel kind of bad for him, but like, no. Exactly. I love the, the relationship those two are building up. What happened? Still move more. Oh, true. Doesn't she give you everything back, though? I could have sworn she does. I might be wrong. This must be it. Ancient sure did a great job making this. Wow, I can protect the planet, too. I'm kind of embarrassed. There's plenty of stuffed toys like my body around, but there's only one me. Don't forget me, even if another kid Sith comes along. Oh, yep. Yeah. Goodbye, then. I guess I'm off to save the planet. I'm pretty sure she gives it back. I think it'd be a bit too cruel if you put certain materia on her or certain things and then she never gave it back. the black materia. I'll wait here. As long as we have this, Sephiroth won't be able to use Meteor. Go, we, we got the black materia. Hmm. Can you guys use it? Nope, we can't use it right now. We need a great spiritual power to use it. You mean lots of spiritual energy? That's right. One person's power alone won't do it. Somewhere special, where there's plenty of the plant's energy. Oh yeah, the promised land. The promised land. No, but... Sephiroth is different. He's not an ancient. You shouldn't be able to find the promised land. Ah, but I have. Far superior to the ancients. Became a traveler of the life stream and gained the knowledge and wisdom of the ancients. I also gained the knowledge and wisdom of those after the extinction of the ancients. And soon I'll create the future. Won't let you do it. The future is not just yours. I wonder. Wake up. Shut up. Noise. Alright, so here we are controlling a little itty bitty cloud. There, cloud. Good boy. And we can't really do much. You can kind of run around and be like, Cloud, no. Don't be afraid. No. Don't be afraid. We can't really just sit here and have a temper tantrum. Can't really do much more about it. Gave the black materia to Sephiroth. Well done. Cloud, are you all right? I gave the black material to Sephiroth? What did I do? Tell me, Aerith. Cloud, be strong, okay? Oh, what have I done? Cloud, you haven't done anything. It's not your fault. I'm... And I, again... He's kind of just wailing on her, and I just... I hope that that's not... In Rebirth. I hope they change that a little bit, because it's... It's a bit much. Cloud? This looks like a... Looks like a bad time. I'm Kate number two. Pleased to meet you all. What are you doing? Stop beating her shins, Cloud. Everything is white. What did I do? I don't remember anything. My memory... since when? If everything's a dream, don't wake me. I... read something about this scene very recently that I need to talk about. 
but I'll point it out when it happens. Cloud, can you hear me? Yeah, I hear you. Sorry for what happened. Don't worry about it. I can't help it. Oh. Then why don't you really worry about it? And let me handle Sephiroth. And Cloud, take care of uh, take care of yourself. So you don't have a breakdown, okay? What is this place? This forest leads to the city of, of the ancients. It's called the Sleeping Forest. It's only a matter of time before Sephiroth uses Meteor. That's why I'm going to protect it. Only a survivor of the Setra like me can do it. The secret is just up here. At least it should be. I feel it. It feels like I'm being led by something. Then I'll be going now. Come back when it's all over. So, someone pointed this out, I think on Twitter initially. She's not looking at Cloud here and waving. She's looking directly at the camera, and that's always going to get me from now on every time I see this. Aerith? You can see when she turns to look at him versus when she's looking directly at us. Oh, really, Ace? That's so funny. Hmm, so she's gonna interfere. She'll be a difficult one, don't you think? We must stop that girl soon. You look like he was having a nightmare. Um, how are you feeling? I don't really know. Guess that's right. Well, don't worry too much about it. You know, Cloud, Aerith is gone. Everyone's out looking for Aerith. City of the Ancients. Aerith is headed there. By herself? Why did she go by herself? Hey, we're going too. Only the Ancients, only Aerith can save us from Meteor. Then we must go. What'll... What do we do if something happens to Aerith? If Sephiroth finds her, she's in trouble. Sephiroth already knows. Hey, why are you still sitting around? Let's go, Cloud. No, I might lose it again. If Sephiroth comes near me, I might... Yeah, goddamn, it's because of you that Sephiroth's got the black materia. It's your damn fault. My fault? I know you got problems. Hell, we all do, but you don't even understand yourself. You gotta understand that there ain't no getting off of this train we're on. So we get to the end of the line. Dad, we came this far. Aren't you gonna settle up with Sephiroth? No, I'm afraid. If this keeps up, I may go crazy. I'm afraid. Goddamn jackass, that's what you are. Just think about it. How many people in this world do you think really understand themselves? People get depressed in life because they don't know what's up. But they go on living. They don't run away. That's just how it is. Dad, you'll come with us, right? I believe in you. What am I supposed to do? Just pull out of here? To where? Cloud. Wait a minute, Tifa. Give him a little time. He has to decide this on his own. You believe in Cloud, right? I hope they do, Brandon. I hope they do. I come to Gungaga of all places. I think it's just technically the closest thing they could get to easily. As far as I know. I'm afraid to find out the truth, but why? There we go. So again, we had a little moment there. Um, it seems like Sephiroth does have some sort of control over Cloud story-wise. We're not sure what exactly that's all about yet, but he made Cloud hand over the Black Materia, which he can use to summon Meteor, which is going to pretty much destroy the planet if he actually succeeds. So Aerith has separated from the group. She's gone off on her own without telling anyone. And she, uh, she's hoping to go to the City of the Ancients for 
reasons. So we're going to try to follow after her. Cloud. Hey, how are you? I just want to know, which is it going to be? You want to find out about yourself or are you afraid to find out? Either way, if you stay around here, all you're going to do is worry about it. Even if you do go nuts again when you see Sephiroth, if it happens, it happens. I'll go upside your spiky head and bring you back to normal. But it'll be all right. We're all here with you. But if it happens, it happens. Don't worry about it. You're right. He's right, isn't he? Come on, let's go and find Aerith. There we go. Okay, now let's take a look here, because we weren't certain. Yeah, she had the fire ring on her. Um, so she does give back what she had. Um, she also had the enemy skill, so you don't have to unequip her or anything like that. She will just give it all back before she leaves, which is very nice of her. Um, so we got Barret with us for just a second here. We're going to leave Gungaga. I am on top of the forest for some reason. <laughs> oh, there we go. I fell down. Um, and from here, we can bring Vincent back. The poor guy got left out of that adventure. Um, but I did grab him a new gun. Oh, but it's the, it's the drug weapon, so it's not going to have any materia for it. Um... I also found some better armlets in there. <clears throat> uh, oh, that's actually a really good one. Drains half of fire, cold, and lightning attack. <gasps> Welcome back, Rebecca. Um, let me just see what everyone else has. So it doesn't have any growth on it, and it does have some decent stats, but when it comes to leveling up our materia, that is kind of important. Okay, so cover and counterattack, I want that on Vincent. It helps get his, um, his limits up. Um, Tifa is going to get the enemy skill back. And maybe I'll give you that. Uh, you can have more if I'm going to need to level that up eventually. And... Um... Uh, looking for my rest today, playing Two Point Hospital. Oh, thank you! Enjoy your lurk, I really do appreciate it. And I hope you're having a good day. I've never played any of the, like, Two Point games, but I've heard good things about them. Uh, gravity and maybe revive? Put some more stuff on cloud here. Uh, so Tifa has a restore. Maybe earth. Um. Still working on your coffee. Enjoy. Sense. Ooh, steel. Get that back. And maybe throw on that luck plus for now. I don't necessarily- you don't need to fill up your material slots, but I kind of like to. Alrighty, um, so we are by Gungaga. And we want to head north. want to head up. Um, I don't know if- and again, this is like- I followed a guide my first playthrough of this game, so I'm not sure exactly how they intend you to figure this out. Um, if it's just trial and error, but pretty much we're gonna go up to a continent we haven't been on. Uh, and we're gonna go to a place called Bone Village, I think, which is kind of a funny name. And, uh, we'll figure out the way to the city of the ancients from there. Th there's probably some NPC that mentions it somewhere. For all I know. Oh, I can't check my menu from here, sorry. I was gonna try to check, um, 
to see if Aerith actually gives back her weapons or not. It's fine if she doesn't. Obviously, no one else can use it. But just, like, out of curiosity. doing thank you so much for the 33 month resub i hope you've been doing good and we can get some hype and some love in chat that is always very appreciated reminds you of the flying vehicles you get in tales of abyss to get around i that's another game there's too many rpgs friends i want to get into the tales series i want to check out golden sun um all right so i think what i want to do here um we're gonna be jumping into emotions the video game <laughs> when we get back um it's gonna be quite a big story beat i don't want to be interrupted in the middle of it so i think i want to go on break now if you guys want to join me get up stretch grab a drink grab a snack do what you gotta do um if you are headed out thank you so much for being here if you're sticking around you get one of those you get the fanfare uh if you're sticking around enjoy the brb videos and i'll be back soon i need to eat so again taking slightly longer breaks, but I'm trying to, you know, not take too, too long. Um, but yeah, enjoy!